Each character module has a total of 8 control layers. These layers can control the pose of the character with a rotation or position channel. When the value becomes 0, it will be an initial pose. The head control has 4 sub-options. These can be used to turn heads or change facial expressions. Double-click head control to activate the head position. The arm can only be controlled with the rotation tool. Double-click lower arm control to activate the hand rotation. The lower arm control has four sub-options. These can specify the shape of the hand or send layers of the arm to the front or back. If the hand shape is set to prop F and prop B, the hand will hold the props item. This toolkit provides over 80 props objects. Search for the props you want in the guide, drag the items in the project panel and replace them with the existing props layer. Replacement can only be done by dropping while holding down the Alt key. Each props composition has a front and back hand shape object. Users can also hide an existing object and insert something into it. For the color of the hand, enter the slot number of the character holding the prop. The legs can be controlled with both IK and FK. The foot control has one sub-option, and Duik Basil is used. For advanced tips on leg control, follow the manual on the script developer. The setup layer located at the bottom of the character has a channel to change the character's texture. The hip control has one sub-option for turning torso. Double-click on the hip control to activate the two triangle tools. By controlling the triangle with the rotation tool according to the pose of the legs, a skirt shape is created. <laughs> 